here. So this is the first time I'm doing this, but for whatever reason, I feel like I should. First off, this is a documentary of what has not been said but should be. And even though I feel like it should not be said or whatever, it will still have to be said anyway. So clearly that's a contradiction, but life goes on. So basically, I'm just at a stage in my life where I'm finding out what I really want after going through the saying yes when I mean no stages of life which happens um, often <laughs> I just feel like I'm the type of person where I do need someone to talk to or not really necessarily need someone but I just have to talk out loud in order to express myself better. And in doing that, I have developed this immense need and demand, rather, in action by demand, to be heard. And if I feel like you're not hearing me, then I don't want to talk to you. Because I feel like I hear you, but you don't hear me. And it might not even be the case. I might be overlooking something that I just don't want to see. Or I was actually seeing it. I feel I honestly was seeing it. But I just didn't understand. And I knew I wasn't going to understand if the conversations like, the, like those or situations like those continue so I would just distance myself or disappear rather from the situation or person that's making me feel that way and I didn't understand why I thought it was because of some developmental shit that we inherit from the people who physically made us um for a long time i just thought the standard old boxed way of believing how life works and like most people as we get older if you had programming or routine or rituals or basically you've been brought up to believe certain things about certain ways and therefore you found yourself in that same box that you're taught to believe and then at some point you just gotta get to a point where you want to break out that box and just experience life outside it and not be afraid and I feel like even though I was raised with very great morals and a very good foundation of how I want to be treated and how I should treat others I still felt like even though that was the teaching um personally I just think my mother just is fearful because even though the message is to not fear there's still a man-made fear being programmed at the same time to keep you from leaving the message. So, I'm sorry. I just wanted to note halfway into this that I'm just now recovering <laughs> from letting myself get so stressed out from overthinking. And I've been dehydrated a lot since I came out of the hospital and I still haven't really drunk enough. So, it looks like I didn't really learn my lesson like I'm trying to. So, let me take a break.